quiet down Cause I can hear a word that you're saying Cause you always shout What's that thing that Raging used to say? That could be a thing in this video It's only for fools and horses Said it's only for fools and horses So don't get into no dirty ketamine Cause it's only for fools and horses Shout out to Regime, big up Regime Welcome back to another instalment of We The D Vlog 3.0 Today, I have Corley with me What's up? Hey uh, Local musician Producing some awesome stuff at the moment um, We also go way back all, I think all of these I go way back with someone You know, I always, yeah. I always start with Oh, I've known this guy for years and Yeah, he I was my drug dealer <laughs> <laughs> Uh, no, I, I've never done that. Corley was not my drug dealer. <laughs> I said that in a way that I was, but I wasn't. <laughs> yeah, bands, yeah. We did a photo shoot in Pembroke. Yeah, did a photo shoot in Pembroke ages ago. Oh, how long ago was that? Four, four or five years ago? Was it? Was it that long? That's yeah, me. five years ago. Yeah, Corley was in Plague Father for a bit. I mean, um, the times of my life. And Yeah. Another duo <laughs> as well called uh, Euthanasia. Yeah. Um, some like heavy trap vibes, kind of along the lines of like Suicide Boys. Plug in, yeah. That, that kind of thing. Um, yeah, heavy, heavy rap, heavy, heavy, heavy something metal influence kind of. If you like Ghost Main. That kind of thing. Ghost Main. But. Gas Main. <laughs> Gas Main. <laughs> He's yeah. currently got some solo tracks coming out though. I'll put a link below to the one from yeah, the other day. I, I dropped, well, unexpectedly dropped a song two days ago. And it's a banger it's as called, well. I hope you're okay. It's super. For you watching, I hope you're okay. I hope you're all okay. If you need a chat, hit me up. I'm here for a chat. I'm not going to tell you where I live, but. <laughs> <laughs> Come for a cup of tea if you know me. <laughs> the song has gone down super well though. Yeah, the last couple of days, hasn't it? Um, got bear views. Yeah, well, I did a couple of covers um, just to sort of like interact with some older audience. Some some people that probably wouldn't even, you know, fuck with my music. Um, <laughs> <laughs> um, you know, just from like here, here's Molly. Like, because oh, um, I'm not even going to go by that name anymore. Just like Corley, just, just Corley. It's my, you know, it's like your name. Everyone knows you as your name, so it's a good place to like start. People will see that and think, oh, he's put music out rather than who's, it, who's this Molly dude. Yeah. I keep it for like euthanasia stuff, but um, yeah, just go as my own name, fresh. For my solo stuff. Yeah, it's like a fresh start. But then mm -hmm. I gotta like change it all on Spotify. Oh, the, the the whole drag of doing all that. The, yeah, they don't like Different let you handles. like change it either. It's like. Um, what I did last time because I came like sort of re released the um, stuff out with my mate Kyle. We did like a single like sometime last year, mm. and I put I put it out as Cooley, and then I was like, oh, I'll just go as Molly because that's who I am in Euthanasia, and then it was just like it's too like SoundCloud rap, you know? yeah. It's I too get you. like oh, young Molly, like, yeah, you know, yeah, peep, like little Gucci main. Indeed. Um, so I was just like, yeah. A few people said, why don't you just you know, why aren't you just your own name? So, just gonna change it back. So, put that out there. I'm just gonna go as Cooley for now. Amazing. Uh, I'll, I'll definitely put a link as well. So Breaking it's news! <laughs> just go as Cooley for now. <laughs> I'll put a link so it's easier to find, <laughs> just in case. But, like, thank you, man. It's so all good. If you go on Spotify and you see it as Molly, it's the same. It's the same thing. I just need to change it. It's a transition period. Damn you, Disco Kid. <laughs> <laughs> Anyway, um, we're putting some stuff together at the moment for an another track that's coming out soon. Some some tasty new beats, which sound absolutely awesome. And we're going to do um, a super sick music video. Yeah. Super good. We're not going to let like give anything away because it's um, it's a high drama one. It's good. It's, it's like a, it's a mix of all emotions. All kinds of carnage. Bit of yeah, bit of drama, bit of comedy. I mean, a lot of dark, darky dark. Yeah, even though the track necessarily isn't that dark. <laughs> yeah, it's no. kind of a bit What's of a... the reason? It juxtaposed. Yeah, juxtaposition. Yeah. What's the job here? So, that, so... so we've just been doing loads of shot listing and like sorting out this music video over the last uh, week or so, but mainly today. Yeah, yeah, like Got sort the... of the bones of it like a week ago, and then we've just 
smashed it today. And the bulk is, is all there. So we've got shot a list and we're going to crack on over the next couple of weeks and whenever we get some good weather and stuff. Put it all together, so that's something you'll definitely see within the next couple, Six of, years. couple of months, hopefully. Get my maximum. <laughs> all good. We're just just weather, like weather will be the, the, yeah. the biggest thing. I think. Storms and I'll need to go more north <laughs> to go film this stuff. Yeah, Scotland's nice at this, at this time, time of year, so. Put Thames on the map with our mad skills. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> <laughs> I've got three questions to ask Corley as a creative and as a musician, so. Bang away, man. Bang away. <laughs> <laughs> Question number one. Who is your biggest creative influence? I can't narrow it down to one. Um, oh, fire away. I'm sure there's there's plenty of that. Okay, so Abba. Nice. For how inconsistently we with genre. Well, I don't mean inconsistent, just like... Varied. Yeah, variety of genre. They just didn't do one thing like a lot of artists, they just do trap or hip hop or metal just yeah just chuck it all in if like I mean I don't mean like dubstep with heavy riffs like just if it's if you can combine it well for like music I'm not talking about lyrics or vocals but in terms of just the music if if it sounds good then yeah and you like it and it's the fit it like I heard somebody say in an interview they did you know black tongue Yes, yeah. And the drummer said, if your album or your EP or whatever you're releasing at that point isn't your favourite thing to listen to, why bother? Yeah. And that doesn't mean like, oh, it's the best, but if like, I find it hard when I'm writing to like, listen to other artists because I don't really want to rip them off. So it's like, oh, it's my favourite, like, you know, doing a bit of pop, doing a bit of like, trap, hip hop, whatever. Mm -hmm. Tend to not like, listen to that. Solely, I'll go to like metal bands and like get bits and bobs yeah, from places. Just, and like uh, one tip I do have is if if you like, you know, everyone gets to a point where you get like writer's block. Mm -hmm. um, smack a film on. I found that worked amazing. Like for like, you know, I didn't really know what to write about. I found like I was like tarnishing the same subjects like heartbreak and you know drugs and all that I, I put on devil's reject mm -hmm. i just put had that on the background and, and breaking bad and it was just really good to like it was just good inspiration to sort of think a little bit more outside of what you were thinking at that time and sort yeah. of put a bit of a flip on it widen so, the, the field of view a bit you know yeah so that um so yeah okay, i've said abba so that does that count yeah definitely um, Legendary. Yeah, always. <laughs> I do have a, a t-shirt and every time someone sees me wearing it, they're like, Dancing Queen, and I'm like, oh no, please go away. Anyone else? What about... Like, Black something? Tongue, yeah, I just need to think, they're, they're a great band, one of my favourite metal bands. Um, shout out Tayen, Eddie, Aaron, I think that's the only boys in the band now, but crazy stuff. You guys changing the game. Class. You guys are changing the game. Abba. Abba. <laughs> That's literally all that's in my head right now. Class. <laughs> it's not even musical, but just going outside. Yeah. Like going to like, you know, when, when you get into like a rut, it's so easy to just be so confined in like your house. Like you're like, oh, I got anxiety. I don't really want to leave the house. And that's like, that's normal. Like. Everyone's got anxiety to an extent, everyone just gets depressed and then you get to a stage where you get socially awkward and you can't go out, but to break those barriers, you just got to go out, you, like you'll find it awkward, you'll find it hard to go out and just chat to people, but until, if you, if you don't do it, it's like anything, isn't it? if you don't yeah. go out and do it, then you just end up in these ruts and end up like wasting your life away, so yeah. go out and meet people, everyone's got a story, and then that's where my inspiration from songs come from. Okay, I listen to artists and I might grab a bit from there and be like, that sounds cool. But mainly just meeting people, like you said, like we met ages ago. Mm. Haven't seen you really for years. You haven't seen me or whatever, we've been doing our own thing. Yeah. And now we're like hanging out and doing stuff together and like 
it might not bring anything in that moment, but you like might go home and that might spark something, you know? Absolutely, yeah, definitely. So yeah, inspiration, ABBA, <laughs> and get the fuck out of your house. <laughs> and do something. Nice, I like that. Question two, where do you see yourself in 10 years time? On a beach in Marbella with my nan, because I've promised you that. Nice, that's awesome. Talking about my nan, <laughs> my nan's calling me. <laughs> Big up nan. Big up nan, hang on, I'm just going to answer the to nan. Hi nan. That was oh, amazing. Top girl. Aww. She looks after me, she asked me what I want for food. Aww, what a legend. Um, Class. Where do I see myself in 10 years? Yeah, beach in Marbella. <sighs> oh yeah, with my nan. With your nan. That is a banger. I like that. Yeah. Still, cheap, still cheap, making beats. Cheap fags, making beats. Nan's happy. Regular visits from the fam. Hoping all my friends are great. Making music always. I yeah. think I'll make music until I'm incapable to make music. I nice. mean, like, even if I can't sing anymore, I can always use auto-tune, can't I? <laughs> oh, I do that now. <laughs> Shout out auto-tune. <laughs> Pick up auto-tune. <laughs> Question three. This is the considerably lighter one of, of all of them. Um, Megadeth, I know already. <laughs> <laughs> what's, what's your favourite pizza topping? What do you order? Uh, I'd say something basic, man. Like, I don't know. I'd, like, like what? Like, say if I went to Tesco's or if I went to a kebab, because, like, the pizzas you can get in, like, Tesco's, you know, you only have, like, you have an option, don't you? Like, say if you went to a kebab, you could have anything on pizza. Mm -hmm. Like, especially if you went to a good one. Yeah. Oh, have, anywhere. Have like, just your favourite. patties on it or whatever. Yeah, just, um, the, just your top one. Like, say if you were going to order one. Probably, or... like, something mad meaty. Like, that's yeah. probably what it's called, isn't it? Like a, a meat feast. Meat, like a meat feast, yeah. Any Mighty extras? Me, uh, some jalapenos. Spice. Um, spice it up a little. One spicy boy. Uh, shout out the jalapeno crew. Um, <laughs> <laughs> uh, I don't really know, I'm quite boring with that. I love sauce. Yeah? yeah. Condiment guy. Uh, yeah, condiment cooly and all. Cond <laughs> Cond condiment cooly. <laughs> That's a new name. Uh, it's my new rap name. <laughs> I'm changing it. <laughs> so uh, it's the third, third iteration of third, the name now. Third alias. Yeah. There's things you can come up with on this couch. Eh? Alright, favourite condiment then. We'll chuck that one uh, in at the end. Okay. And that's special for me, is it? Yeah. It's, <laughs> uh, got, it's gotta be. Oh, I love burger sauce. Damn right. Oh, it is. Just the mix of garlic and. Yeah. The sauce. Oh yeah, I just love sauce. Sweet chilli sauce, hot sauce, Do you know any, any sauce, raw sauce. The only one recently is the early old sriracha mayo. Oh, sriracha, I missed that one out. Big up sriracha. Sriracha That's mayo so is good. banging. Yeah. Is it like in the orange? Yeah, yeah. you can get the just normal red standard. That's the one. Shout out hot ones. Hot ones. Big up hot um, ones. we do a little bit of the hot ones plug. We should do a hot ones on oh, here, should we? Oh yeah, should we? I should do a hot ones vlog. We should Definitely do that. I just I mean see who would sweat As much as I like hot sauce, I would probably suck at that challenge. Yeah. I mean like That's a like there are a lot. Like there's a lot going on. Have you seen Gordon Ramsay on that? Yeah. And he just starts moaning about the wings and he's like, We're gonna sponsor you, get you some decent fucking meat on these <laughs> on these wings and all he's like, When you look at your arm and it's like he's like, That's a decent bit of meat on it, isn't it? He's yeah. like he's like these things he's like fucking sand <laughs> <laughs> So I try to laugh and talk. Um class. But yeah, I think that's it, man. Pretty much meat, meat feast, pizza with jalapenos and a fuck ton of burger sauce. Spawn. Big up, dudes. Cheers very much. Thanks for watching. <laughs> if you see me on the street, I know I'd probably give off a standoffish vibe, but I'm, I'm pretty chill. He's alright, really. Same, same as Dean. <laughs> what am I trying to say? Keep being sound and yeah. the wheel goes round. <laughs> You, you. Cheers. <laughs> Cheers for sticking with us. Uh, going to shoot a gig tomorrow, uh, or the, the day that this comes out. Um, it's my dream gig. I'm going to shoot City in Colour, my favourite band. Oh, cool. Tomorrow, London Palladium. Uh, so there'll be an album of that up on Noise as well soon that I'll do a share of. And stay tuned to uh, eventually check out our music video that we're producing at the moment. Big up dudes, I'll see you on the next one. All I want is to say that I hope you're okay. I think about you daily, can't get you out of my head.